Okay, we're back with Coach Taurus, and a lot of people who read the Huskies Outsider blog have been asking about the team and what BT's feelings are heading into the spring camp. So we've uh, rounded them up again, and we're going to ask them to go, maybe go through the roster a bit, p position by position. And maybe, BT, we can start with uh, quarterbacks. Well, quarterbacks are not going to see any change from last year, uh, really. Uh, Lawrence Nixon is uh, a, a solid starter. He's uh, going into kind of his uh, second year, year as a full-time starter and had a great year for us last year. Uh, Lawrence has got all the tools and uh, makes all the throws. He's had a good offseason. We're looking forward to him. He'll be backed up by Trevor Bars and Parker Siemens. And uh, we will have a new face at number four. We're not sure who that's going to be yet. All right, maybe we'll switch then to the running backs. Uh, Tyler Gorman, uh, you know, is back. Uh, he should be uh, should be a little healthier than he was last year. Coming off knee surgery last year, didn't quite have uh, his burst that he'd had the year before before he got hurt. So he's had another uh, you know another nine months of offseason good training. He ran some track this year. We're kind of expecting Tyler to come back with a little bit more of the speed that he showed as a second-year player when we won the conference and uh, he was player of the game in the playoffs a couple times. So uh, he'll get the bulk of the the. Uh, the carries. Okay, third year player Mark Klaus is, is also going to get the ball a little bit this year, especially in the spring. We want to see what he can do. Uh, unfortunately, Mark was hurt most of last year with a little bit of a neck problem, but uh, he's back healthy and uh, we kind of expect him to show the promise that uh, that he had coming out of high school. He's very fast and uh, and we want to get him the ball. And uh, The other guy we're looking forward to really seeing is one of our top recruits this year is Jeff Hassler. Uh, without doubt, he's one of the most exciting players and one of the better players coming out of the Alberta high school system this year. Uh, he, he lit up the uh, Canada Under-17 uh, championships as both a receiver and a running back. and uh, He uh, definitely is one of our top recruits. We're going to see what, uh, what Jeff can do uh, when we hand him the ball in the spring. Um, I guess the unknown factor we have right now at tailback is, uh, is the status of Dathan Thomas. His rehab has gone great. Uh, we haven't tested it too much, but uh, the knee is sound. Uh, he's, uh, he's rehab is ahead of schedule, and he's doing everything that we could ask him, but uh, we'll just have to wait and see where he's at, probably come fall. All right, when you look at receivers, you lost a couple of people due to graduation, but there's still some veterans returning. Yeah, you know, uh, we, we lose Phillips and, uh, and uh, a couple guys, but... Uh, Right now, uh, we do have a veteran group back, probably led by Corey Jones and, uh, and Travis Gorski. Those guys have started for us for three years. Uh, they know the league inside out. Uh, Travis is tough. Uh, Jones, he's real fast. He's real smart, and he can get open. Uh, we aren't sure what's going to happen with Scott McHenry. Obviously, he's going to go in the CFL draft, and uh, and uh, you know, for Scott's sake, we hope that he makes it. If he doesn't, then he certainly will have the opportunity to come back and. Uh, and play a fifth year for for us. But uh, a couple other guys came into their own last year. Braden George had a great year as a, as a redshirt freshman last year, traveled with us all the time, and Jeff Moore also had an exciting year for us. So uh, those two guys are going to step right in, and we won't miss a beat there. Uh, remains to be seen right now who we're going to start at the other wideout, but uh, that's what spring camp and training camp is going to be for. And take a look at the offensive line. You've got a couple of veterans returning there as well. Uh, yeah, we, you know, we, we're going to return most of the guys from last year, and... Uh, and uh, you know Hubert Bidens will be back to lead us, and uh, and Darren Hines will be back uh, healthy and uh, and in better shape, I think, uh, this year than he was a year ago at center. Uh, Patty Newfeld's going into his second year as a starting tackle, and then Ben Heenan, our rookie of the year last year, uh, was uh, was outstanding, and he's had another great off season. So four of those five guys returning. Uh, I'm not sure who's going to play the other spot. We got five or six guys we're looking at at the at that other guard spot or the center spot and uh, there's going to be some great competition at camp there. All right coach and for people interested in the defense we'll take a look at that tomorrow. Thanks. Perfect. Thanks man.